Today, we will explore the issue of fornication, focusing on the unique struggles faced by single individuals. Let's dive in. As a single person, it's natural to desire love, intimacy, and physical connection. However, we must navigate this journey with caution, as the Bible strongly condemns the act of fornication. In various passages, the scriptures emphasize the importance of sexual purity and honoring God's design for relationships. Fornication, as defined in the Bible, refers to engaging in sexual activities outside of the covenant of marriage. It includes premarital sex and any sexual immorality that goes against God's plan for intimacy within the boundaries of marriage. Now you might be thinking, but I'm single, how does this concern me? Temptation can arise in our lives, in the lives of single individuals, leading to moments of vulnerability when our desire for love and physical connection becomes overpowering. It is during these times that the potential for engaging in sexual immorality may tempt us. Let's explore what the Bible has to say about relationships. In 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 18, we read, Flee from sexual immorality. All other sins a person commits are outside of the body, but whoever commits sexual sin sins against their own body. God's intention is for sexual intimacy to be within the context of a committed marital union. Fornication is viewed as a grave sin in the eyes of God. In Hebrews chapter 13 verse 4, it states, Marriage should be honored by all, and the marriage bed kept pure, for God will judge the adulterer and all the sexually immoral. This verse underscores the importance of honoring marriage and preserving sexual purity. Proverbs 4.23 advises, Above all else, guard your heart, for everything you do flows from it. As single individuals, it is crucial to guard your hearts and minds against immoral thoughts and actions. We must cultivate a strong relationship with God, filling our hearts with His Word and seeking His guidance daily. Overcoming temptation is a challenging but essential aspect of our spiritual journey. 1 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 13 assures us, No temptation has overtaken you, except what is common to mankind. And God is faithful. He will not let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. But when you are tempted, He will also provide a way out so that you can endure it. As followers of Christ, we are called to pursue sexual purity. 1 Thessalonians chapter 4 verse 3 to 5 says, it is God's will that you should be sanctified, that you should avoid all sexual immorality, that each of you should learn to control your own body in a way that is holy and honorable, not in passionate lust like the pagans who do not know God. We are called to honor God with our bodies and pursue holy and honorable relationships. Being single doesn't exempt us from the call to sexual purity. While the temptation to engage in fornication may arise, we must stand firm in our faith, relying on God's strength to resist temptation. Seek accountability through a trusted community and be vigilant in maintaining purity of your heart. It's not an easy journey, but it is an important part of our walk with God. Thank you for joining me today as I explore the topic of fornication, focusing on the challenges faced by single individuals. May God's word guide you and guard you as we navigate relationships and pursue righteousness. If you liked this video and want to watch more like this, be sure to find GNPI Uganda on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Until next time.